do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students let us move to the next question of the same paragraph 1 that is question number 38 so let us see what is the answer to that question students let us solve the next part of that question that is uh, two questions given this is the second question of the same paragraph if two structures of same cross sectional area two structures so we have got two structures the area of cross section being same so we have got same area of cross section but different numerical approaches so for this the numerical aperture and for this the numerical aperture apertures are different it is given that na2 is less than na1 so here na2 and here it is na1 so what is the difference and what the difference does it make when it is a case are joint longitudinally so one after another along the length you have to join so that means uh, this one is joined here here suppose this is the second one this is uh, how it is joined here longitudinally along the length so this one is having a uh, refractive uh, numerical aperture less numerical aperture so it will be something like that something like that so here the numerical aperture less so the numerical aperture of the combined structure so if i take these two structures simultaneously then the numerical aperture will be of the combination will be what what is na combination that is the question now our purpose is to numerical aperture basically defines the capacity of light to enter through the fiber suppose that here the critical angle uh, in this case is achieved or this is the maximum angle through which uh, this light can be entered and it can go total internal reflection in this first one and the second one this is the angle this is the maximum angle because if it is more than that if it is more than that then there will be no total internal reflections so basically the difference is that uh, the question is that if suppose that in simple i just explain to you in the first structure the suppose that the critical angle is 30 degree and the second one the critical angle is 20 degree that means if the angle of incidence is more than the critical angle then only the total internal reflection will take place so if in case of 20 then it's okay because 20 is uh, the minimum then if it is more than 20 then also there will be total internal reflection but the first case suppose that total internal reflection the, the critical angle is suppose uh, uh, is happening at uh, 30 degree then if you allow the light to enter at an angle of 25 then there will be no total internal reflection in the first case but in the second case it will be the total internal reflection so for the structure to allow the light to pass through or to have a total internal reflection the numerical aperture should be of the combination should be the least value of the two that means the numerical aperture of the combination it should be
it should be lesser one of the two so we have got two choices n a 1 and n a 2 which is having less one n a 2 this is lesser this is smaller and this is greater so the combination will have this one because if this is the then if you follow this the light will enter to the combination so answer to this question is n a 2 so this is the answer okay thank you